We just wrapped up a fantastic weekend on Lake Michigan. We were going after brown trout and we tried for Lakers a little bit, but ended up getting browns with that as well. But we primarily vertical jigged, we casted, and we also trolled and had success doing all those three methods. Yeah, it was great. The water temps around 39 to 42 degrees. We found the trout in five to 30 feet deep, uh, casting up shallow, also jigging and running dipsies in that 30 foot range. And they seem to be everywhere, uh, hugging tight to the bottom cover, but it was great. All right, stay tuned for some action packed footage. Hooked up by the rocks. So funny, you saw it surface, cast to it. You saw it surface. Why do we the same one? What do you think? Pretty fun. Little lagoon. Some light line. Yeah, hopefully. Let me see if I can snag this one in the back. Yep. Little one, but another nice buck. You got mouth on that thing. Well, cool. you saw one, you cast it to it, and made it happen. Yeah. That's all about. On the rip and wrap. It's a little messed up right there. This fish has been caught a few times. Yeah. All right, sweet. So nice. Cool. Alrighty, let's get them back. Another big brown. Got all tangled up in the trolling motor remote. This thing's got big head shakes. It's a nice fish. Oh, he's out there. Fighting hard. Spot lock, I think. Get the net ready. I can grab the net if you want. Oh okay, god, sure. Oh, that's a nice one. Nice. Nice color. Come around to the back here. Oh, wow, got me a scooper. I can get that. You got it. Nice. Nice little one. Nice. There we go. Found a nice one. Nice buck. That's what it's all about out here. Just tossing a tube jig again. A lot of fun. A lot of big head shakes. It's always a good time. Get them back here. Off he goes. Oh, I just got bit, dude. Yeah, oh, it's chasing me still. Chasing me down hard. Oh, it's coming up again. Got him. Fish on. Nice. Get the net. Get the net. Oh, brown, brown. Oh, that was a laker. I switched modes on a sonar. I've been trying to learn how to use it and it's a big expensive piece of technology. So I thought I better start playing around with settings and learn something. So I'm on the graph and made it happen. There we go. That's a nice brown, a C for Ellen. I like your ultralight rod there. 
That's the wall I rod, the ugly stick, old style. All right, ready? There you go. Let's go, high five. Woo! Nice. That's the way to do it. Sweet. All right, nice chromed up brown. This would be a good eater. We're gonna keep this one. Usually silver ones better eating than those nasty lagoon browns. So you can see those things, uh, some fungus on them. They've been around the block a few times, so. Good eater right here. Watch the chase up. A lot of energy, a lot of fun. Toss them in here quick and good to go. That's what I got that one on. Classic tube jig with some purple on it and a little bit of uh, gold flash to it. Works really well for these fish. Oh, that's Dipsy, you can have it. Too good. Mm-hmm. You're not warm now, too? That looks like a fish. Got pretty dang small. But there's also an 8 inch brown trout here. So yeah, start somewhere. Oh. oh, fish, fish, fish. Yep. No, it's fine. Just It's a nice one. Waypoint, waypoint. I mean, get us through the gap here. Oh, he wants to go on our other line. Can you see what it is yet? Oh, it's big. Oh yeah, it does look nice. I like your dipsy idea. Could have another one on the other. Okay, now it's getting hairy with waves. Oh yeah, that's a nice brown. We're gonna head out to sea here. I'm gonna take my time on this one. Let's bring him to the other side, maybe. I don't know. Not huge, but it's a fish that popped the dipsy. You don't get that on the. Another buck. That's a little too loose. Yeah, I'm just gonna drive us straight out so we don't get tangled. A Howie spoon on. I think this is a steelhead series one, so. Yeah, this is, Brown wants to be a steelhead today. Oh yeah. I was trying not to put too much pressure on right now, trying to get him in. I'm bringing him to you. Go to the front of the boat. And get it. Ready? Got him? Sweet. Beautiful brown again. Tried a little bit of trolling, switched it up, and we had a dipsy out and got smoked with a uh, chartreuse spoon. So here we go, give you a good look at the kite here. There we go, we're gonna keep going here and catch more fish. That's the hope, at least. There she goes, back to the depths. Another healthy one. Got a nice one on. Hey, 
That looks like a big fish. Funny thing is, uh, Josh and I had a debate today about uh, the difference between a six color light core and some dipsies, and we already had the six color light out there, and I told him let's keep it out, but he kept asking to put out another dipsy, but sure enough, this one had to go. Um, Try and trusty six color, uh, Howie's uh, orange spoon. A little bit of pink in there, whatever you want to call it. Get her to me. Okay, you ready? Yep. Get him, Josh. Get him. How's he feel? Big. Big? Bigger than How big are you thinking? 10 pounds. 10 pounds? Bigger than Lake Superior, but. Yeah, everyone's been uh, itching out of two harbors, but it's been open for a while. I wish I could stop the boat, but not much we can do. 25 incher. I can't imagine those big ones. The actual giants. Yeah. It's a lively one, that's for sure. Uh -huh. Got a duck. Oh no, he's he's gone. Oh, but he's going over to the Dipsy. Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah, I think he did. Hold up. I don't know what to do here. He's... All right, well, he's in the net. Let's see her, Josh. I think she's a he. It's a heat. Yeah. Uh, right. Big kite. What do you think? Pretty fun. It's awesome. Smoke the spoon. Six On. color. Uh, yep. Six color works. Yep. Probably down about 18, 20 feet, depending on how fast we're going at the time. Yep. But let's get this one back. Give her a toss. It's good. 20. Slip her in. Five feet of water. Go. Off she goes. Woo. That'll be the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching and please like and subscribe. We're gonna have some fun action coming this summer with some king salmon fishing.